Hey friends, today we're going to do a story called When Marcus Moore Moves In. Have you ever moved? Mm, I've moved a few times. It's always kind of fun and kind of crazy. <laughs> so let's see what happens when Marcus Moore moves in. Share my screen. All right. At 44 McDougal Street, when Marcus Moore moved in. I'm here, said Marcus Moore, but there was no one there. There was no one coming up the street. There was no one coming down. There were only beds and boxes. There were only rolls of rugs. There was only early morning and there was only him at 44 McDougal Street when Marcus Moore moved in. Then tap, 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 right beside his stoop, like a sunny sidewalk dancer, a girl went skipping by and ringle, jingle, jangle, there she was again with noisy bursts of music. She rang her bicycle bell. She stomped and tromped and swaggered, crunch, crunch, crunch. She lifted high her heels, kaplop, 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 and boom, da boom, da boom, da. Like that, she banged her drum at 44 McDougal Street when Marcus Moore moved in. Wait, cried Marcus Moore, but she was gone too fast and the sky was turning dark and it began to rain. And there was only grim and gray and there was only him at 44 McDougal Street when Marcus Moore moved in. Then knock, 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 may I come in? Marcus heard it clearly. And she was at his doorway. Come in, cried Marcus Moore. I'm Marcus Moore, said Marcus Moore. I'm Catherine Brown, said Kate. And at once he felt all rosy, like that his street had changed beneath the tick and tack, tack, tack and pound, pound, pound of rain at 44 McDougal Street when Marcus Moore moved in. And all the afternoon that day when the su summer storm had ended, they went tap, tap, tapping up and down the streets. They went ringle, jingle, jangle and crunch, crunch, crunch. They went co-op, co-op, co -oping. And boom, buddy, boom, buddy, boom. They stayed and played beneath the trees and overseas they sailed. At 44 McDougal Street, when Marcus Moore moved in. And in the early evening, when the day was blue and dusty, with smells of dinner cooking with lightly layered dust, uh, with lightly layered dark, there were people coming up the street. There were people coming down. There were steps and stoops and sidewalks. There were trucks. There were dogs and trucks and trees. Ooh, that's a lot of words. And there was Marcus Moore at home and Catherine Brown with him at 44 McDougal Street when Marcus Moore moved in. <laughs> so it sounds like he had an exciting day and it sounds like he made a new friend. So I think he and Catherine Brown will be good friends. I hope you have good friends where you live. Okay, have a great day, friends. Bye-bye.